Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Uh, I'm gonna do a video of the Aoshima Nissan Silvia S15 Spec R. I kinda started off with some primer and later on you'll see the color I chose for this beast. For the first coat of primer I'm gonna start it off slow, uh, not too thick, just a very thin uh, first coat and then build it up slowly. Now that the body received its first coat of primer, we can move on to the hood, chassis, and front bumper. The Zero Paints primer dries really fast, so uh, while I was spraying the front bumper, hood and uh, chassis, the body had enough time to dry, so uh, I just continued on painting with that.
primer coat is now done, and uh, I'm going to move on to the color coat. Uh, I'm going to leave this for about five minutes, or just about how long it takes to mix up the color. The color I chose for this one is Rosso Rubino. It's a, it's a Ferrari color. It's a dark red metallic. Uh, kind of looks like candy apple, but less candy-ish, I guess. Uh, I think it'll look pretty good on this one, and uh, I'm going to build it up in about two coats, because red covers really fast. Uh, this first coat is going to be, I think, about 70-80% to coverage, and the second one is just uh, to add some more depth in the color, and uh, make sure I got everything the first time.
as you can see, the red is covering really fast. Uh, the first coat is about 70 to 80 percent coverage. Uh, so the second coat will be the final coat. that the second and final coat is on, uh, I'm going to leave this to dry for about 10-15 minutes, add some decals and continue on with the clear. Put on the decals, gonna leave that for 40 minutes and start on the clear. The decals had about 40 minutes to, to dry up and uh, the clear is now being added. Uh, the clear is mixed up in a ratio of 10 millimeters of clear, 7.5 millimeters of hardener, and uh, 3 to 4 millimeters of thinners. Uh, as you can probably see when you use zero paints, uh, it has a standard advisory of uh, the mixing ratio. Uh, that's about 10 millimeters of clear, 5 millimeters of hardener, and 10 to 30 percent of thinners. Uh, I personally have been working with this stuff for about uh, three to four years and uh, figured out about the second or third time that that ratio could be changed in my advantage uh, by using the extra hardener uh, the, the clear dries faster and you can start working on your model the next day uh, or the day after and the extra thinners um, makes it easier to spray down and uh, a lot easier to get a great shine on it.
the chassis and hood only needed one coat of clear. I, I put it on pretty thick and uh, it gave the result I wanted, a shiny and smooth finish. The front bumper and body needed another coat of clear, so uh, I put that on a little lighter, gave it a smooth finish and uh, left it at that. Well guys, this one's finished, uh, came out pretty good, great shine, love the color, don't have to polish it or anything, uh, gonna add some black trim and some detailed painting next week, uh, probably make a video of that one. In the meantime, check out my Facebook for project updates, uh, shoot me an email if you got a question, and I uh, hope to see you next time, thanks for watching.